Here's how to get Axiom 1.21.7 so you could start customizing your worlds however you want easily in the latest Minecraft. Let's go. Now, the first step to install Axiom is to click the second link in the description, which is going to place you in the Axiom page. In here, select game version, select 1.21.7 and go ahead and hit download right here. That will begin the download for the Axiom mod right away. And if you already have Fabric as a mod loader installed in your computer, all you have to do is add Axiom to your mods folder. Make sure you have the Fabric API and that's it. You're done. But I'm assuming most of you don't have Fabric or the Fabric API. So for the next step, we need to download the Fabric API. That's going to be the third link in the description this is a requirement for axiom to work so click in that link select game version 1.21.7 and hit download right here for the most recent 1.21.7 file for fabric api now go ahead and place that file in your desktop again it should be here on your recent download history or within the default downloads folder of your computer again all we have to do is drag and drop it into our desktop now lastly we need to download the fabric installer this is going to be the fourth link in the description this is a quick article in here in case i go too fast in this video but if you want to go straight to the point just go down to step one press on fabric that is going to redirect you to this page where we're going to click download universal jar that will begin the download for the fabric installer right away and just like we did earlier we're going to place this file in our desktop and now we are done downloading things i promise you now the next step is to install the fabric installer first make sure you have closed your minecraft game as well as your minecraft launcher and after that just go ahead and double click on the fabric installer if it doesn't open for whatever reason don't worry i'm gonna teach you how to fix that in just a second but if it does open we're going to select 1.21.7 and we're going to hit install and like i was saying if it didn't open it's probably because you don't have java 21 java 21 it's required when modding Minecraft 1.21.7 since Java 21 will allow you to open jar files. I'll leave you this article in the description. All you have to do though is just head over to Java 21 page, hit download, and then hit next a couple of times in the installer and you'll be able to open this type of files, the jar files, which will let you mod the game. Now, once we finish installing Fabric, let's go ahead and press done in here or press OK. You could close the Fabric installer. You don't need that anymore. And you could even delete it from your desktop because we won't be using it anymore. Now it's time to add these mods into the game. For that, go ahead and open your Minecraft launcher. And when the Minecraft launcher opens, if you install Fabric properly, you should see it selected here automatically as you can see for me that's the case but we're not going to hit play just yet because we need to add the mods for that head over to installations and make sure that you have modded selected right here on the top and after you select modded you should see fabric right here i want you to hover over fabric and then go ahead and press where it says open installations folder that is going to open a folder that contains a lot of files don't freak out we're just looking for a folder called mods and my mods folder is right here but i'm actually going to delete it to teach you what to do if you don't have it if you don't have a mods folder all you have to do is press new press folder and then just name it mods m-o-d-s it's that simple now go ahead and open your new mods folder which is probably empty by now and now go ahead and drag and drop axiom as well as the fabric api into this folder they should be here on your desktop if you want to add any other mods just make sure they are compatible with fabric and compatible with minecraft 1.21.7 as well as with axiom now it's time to test out axiom you can close the mods folder head back to the minecraft launcher and hit play on your fabric loader now if this is the first time you're launching fabric you might get a prompt just read through it if you agree hit play one more time and you'll be inside the game in no time now while we wait for minecraft to open if you need a minecraft server i'll leave you the first link in the description where you guys only the first 25 people to click it will get 25 percent off with apex hosting you already know why i love apex hosting and you will also be supporting the channel if you make your server using that first link so again get 25 percent off with apex hosting making your minecraft server now once the game opens it's time to test out axiom let's go ahead and launch a single player world again if you want to use axiom on your own multiplayer world you're gonna have to own the server so you can use that first link down below in the description now here we are in minecraft and it's time to text axiom out as you can see we could set up the first point and all of that i'm not an expert using axiom Axiom, but if you want to access the Axiom screen, all you have to do is press shift on your keyboard. So if you press shift right under your enter key, you will see the Axiom screen here. And again, I'm not an expert using it, but I know there's a lot of things you could do in here. This is kind of like a world edit mixed with like Marika, except it's like much better, supposedly. So yeah, you're now free to start using Axiom and start changing your world around however you want. And there you guys have it. How to install Axiom 1.21.7. If this video helped you out, don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you guys next time.